Hello everyone, my name is Yossi Gestetner. I'm co-founder of OJPAC, OJPAC. A few days ago, a 49-year-old passed away in Spring Valley from COVID-19. He has a few children, in-laws, grandchildren, siblings, parents. You would imagine a person of this family size would probably have dozens and dozens of people show up before the burial. What I have in my hand, however, is a notice of violation of $2,000 that the Rockland County Health Department placed at the door of the widow. That she violated social distancing rules for hosting an event. Now, first of all, from a moral perspective, how bankrupt and cold-hearted can you be to do this to a widow? Secondly, according to your own complaint, it says you observed seven people standing in front, 12 people in the rear of the property not adhering to social distancing, which again illustrates to you that a large portion of the family didn't even show up. Thirdly, even if those people did violate the distancing rules, go and give them a summons. Why and how do you give a summons to the widow who was merely at home and waiting for the burial of her own spouse. It doesn't even make sense from a legal perspective and from a moral perspective. It is high time for County Executive Ed Day to make sure that his departments enforce the rules and the laws in an even-handed way. The golf clubs in Rockland County are open. Great. How often does he have inspectors there to make sure that people social distance? That there aren't seven people standing together, maybe. A few days ago, a chief in one of the towns here in Rockland passed away. I saw photos of many members standing there for the funeral. They didn't social distance. Was the county there to hand out the summons? A summons to the family? I don't think so. So, as I said before, from a moral perspective, how bankrupt can you be to do this to a widow? And from a legal perspective, it doesn't even make sense and from a practical perspective from the amount of people that it, that the inspector says that he saw here it's clear to me that it, most of the family didn't even show up and even if they did show up please give them the 50 minutes to bury a loved one thank you very much